The Forge is prime real estate in hell. This smoggy shithole is located over the richest mineral veins in the afterlife. You want to hurt hell's infrastructure? Here's where you do it. these things can do. My lawyer, Legal Lee, figured out a way to get some gold-level clients a fast track out of hell. The more abuse you put these guys through, the more years we can shave off. Lee suggested running clients through the designated intersections to boost their punishment. Oh, and dive in front of those vehicles on fire for bonus points. I mean, let's face it, the more they hurt, the sooner we can get these wretched bastards out of here. While his wife Laura was admitted into heaven, the Heavenly Father was less forgiving of poor Tobias, whose shirtless antics as a crazed drug dealer firmly earned him a place inside the Great Inferno. However, ever the optimist, Tobias tried to look on the bright side of being transformed into a husk. After all, while the removal of his signature dreadlocks was a disappointment, he was finally free from having to wear pants ever again. But while Perpetual Commando appealed to Tobias, he still yearned for Laura and her delightful snickerdoodles. Touched by his story and terrified by his demeanor, Legal Lee worked with renewed purpose to unite the two lovers. Oh! <laughs> 
right, buddy, let's take this opportunity to stretch those wings. I've set up a rudimentary flight path through the city. All you need to do is hit the checkpoints in the order they appear. Now, because I'm a swell guy, I put some orbs out there to help you. The white ones will recharge your wings. The green ones will give you more stamina. Let's go. See what these things can do. Okay, I have a thought on how we can get the attention of Satan, and I really think you're gonna like this one. Blow the shit out of everything, and I mean everything! Demons, cards, and this is a real popular. Just tear this place apart.
All right, it's salvation time. Satan's using his magic to send souls skyward and downward into oblivion. That's where you come in. Catch the falling souls before they hit ground and use an arcane blast to free the souls rising up. Of course, once you do that, you'll still have to catch them before they drift off to their death. Speed is key here. You'll get a bonus for every soul you can save before touching down. Now let's go save some clients. I mean soul. Poor, poor souls that need help. This is bad. I built my combo up before I can do it again. How to keep this combo going? The combo was nice while it lasted. Let's see what these things can do. just entered one of four soul extraction facilities. This is where souls enter hell to have their sins removed and then thrown to the streets to wander for eternity. Now make no mistake, this isn't Satan being magnanimous. Sins are the currency in hell. That means these places are the cornerstone of his income. There's three sections of the facility, and to fully take it over, you need to capture all three. But be careful. Satan's goons are going to be looking to reclaim any section you're not guarding. 
We pull this off, you'll hurt Satan and Ultor makes money. It's win-win. Great work. Old Tor is moving into the territory you freed up, and we're already seeing a difference. I can't wait to see what happens when we own it all. Looks like you fast-tracked a couple of my clients straight to the big white and flow.